Welcome back, everyone. So it's Tasty Tuesday, and we're learning about Olive Garden's new dish that is perfect for healthy eating this summer. Yep, here to tell us more about the Zoodles Primavero <laughs> that we have here this morning is Brock Zimmerman. Thanks for being here, Brock. Absolutely. Thank you for having me. I mean, the table looks beautiful, and whenever you go into Olive Garden, it's going to be great food, but sometimes it's really heavy, so y'all have some really good options for us. Absolutely. So we try to make sure that no matter what the option is, um, it's always that same delicious, craveable Italian food. Mm -hmm. um, but like you said, it being summertime especially, um, you're trying to squeeze into a bathing suit without looking like you're squeezing in. <laughs> right. So we've got our new Zoodles Primavera. Uh, it's inspired by the taste of the Mediterranean part of our menu, which is actually all those options are under 600 calories. Oh, really? So, yep. So oh, that wow. includes um, all these fresh vegetables mm -hmm. in front of you, which is what nice. most Primavera dishes are. So we're mm -hmm. actually going to cook it up for you this morning. Okay. Um, so first thing we like to do is we like to add a little bit of oil to our pan. Okay. So one of the big things with this is all the fresh vegetables, absolutely key. You want to make mm -hmm. sure that you don't take any shortcuts there. Mm. So we have here our seasoned tomatoes that we make mm. in-house. We're going to add some mushrooms over here. Can I, can I taste those tomatoes? You sure can. Oh, man, they look really good. Want to taste that? Yeah. Seasoned with what? <laughs> um, well, we can't give away all of our secrets, <laughs> but I will tell you basil is a huge mm. part of this entire dish. Wow. Oh, so we're going to add do. some mushrooms oh, there. We're going to do some red peppers as mm. well. And then we've got our carrots. Nice and healthy. Indeed. <laughs> you see, all of these things are nice and healthy, and they're all relatively easy to find. So like you said, go ahead. Oh, sorry, I was going to say, do the carrots uh, get tender pretty quickly? They do. So okay. you want to put all this in here for about two minutes as okay. far as the veggies go. Oh, um, that's pretty fast. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. And so with the zoodles, like you mentioned earlier, they are actually zucchini noodles. Um, mm -hmm. You can buy yourself a spiralizer and do it at home, or there are some grocery stores that will actually sell them like that already. Okay. Um, and one of the things that makes this dish, it's pretty new to us. We've only had it for a few weeks, um, but we've got this new sauce over here that I'm going to put in just a minute. It's our primavera sauce, but it's a light creamy basil sauce. Mm. Um, so it's really fresh. It gives you that feeling that you're eating something that you should be eating, okay. which is not a feeling <laughs> so I get a whole lot. Bad. So, absolutely. <laughs> yeah. right. absolutely. All right. So, so you, you do that for about two minutes. minutes. Yeah, for about two minutes. Mm -hmm. And then you're going to add the sauce over there. Okay, and so we're the sauce do that. before the zoodles? Yep, we're going to do oh. because the thing about zoodles is just like if you're cooking zucchini at home, mm -hmm. zucchini, there's such a fine line between when it's done and when it's mushy. And yeah. I'm not a big fan of baby food, so I try <laughs> to stay away from that. Um, but after you add the sauce, that only goes for about a minute, and then you only want those zoodles for about 30 seconds so okay. they don't get too soggy like All right, that. Good to know. All right. All right. So uh, as you're doing that, mm -hmm. um, you have other things as well. Can you, you said you could put chicken and, and shrimp in yep. that? So the great thing about this is it is a vegetarian dish, but mm -hmm. when you come to the restaurant, if you're like me and you eat as much as you possibly can, <laughs> just in case the salad and breadsticks don't fill you up, um, you can add shrimp, you can add chicken, just about anything you want to wow. it. Um, but as far as the vegetarian part of it, that's one of the nice options a lot of people like about this as well. Okay. All right. So you're saying this cream sauce is, is not bad for you? Because usually you see no. cream, it's like, oh boy, there go all the calories and fat. You well, know? you know what they say, well, um, a, second, a second. little bit of everything is yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. So same with that. Uh, as long yeah. as it's not a bunch of the sauce, you'll be okay. That's yeah. very nice. There you go. I like that. That yeah. coupled with oh, the, yeah. you know, the, these great tasting oh. tomatoes, which were with the basil. You gotta give us the secrets of these mm -hmm. tomatoes at some point. Can you give mm -hmm. us a hint? I'm not that smart. I don't know all <laughs> the secrets. That's very good. Mm -hmm. Well, right. thank you so much for coming in. You're welcome. Olive Garden, and um, where are you guys located? Um, we are the one in Spartanburg, um, mm -hmm. so feel free to come. I know somebody here on set earlier said they're coming here for dinner tonight. Great ah. choice, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, you can find this at any one of the Olive Gardens, and you can check out, there's also a lunch uh, version mm -hmm. of this at a couple of the Olive Gardens, <laughs> so you're welcome to order that during mm. the summer. That looks Not fill you up too much. Awesome, Brock. And it's fast, right? Yes, yeah. that was fast. There you go. Stay with us. We have more Carolina Morning on the way.